What's up? We're Aaron Berlin. We're going to take you down memory lane. For the last 40 years of all seven of our albums. We started writing Blueprints for the Black Market. Uh, I was 15 years old. We just started writing, and I think with the first record, there's a lot of pressure, obviously, you know. We, we'd done a demo, or a couple demos before that, um, with Matt Goldman, and uh, that's how we got signed to Tooth and & Nail. And then uh, we went to Seattle and made Blueprints for the Black Market with uh, Aaron Sprinkle in Seattle. But before they made that record, I was in a band from Seattle, actually, and we had done an EP with Aaron Sprinkle, and he started talking about this band, Amber Lynn, from Florida. And we were like, oh, wow, this band's good. They're totally biting our style. <laughs> oh, real <laughs> cool. But so, yeah, they ended up recording with the same producer. Yeah, that we well, we used. heard the EP that he had done, that Aaron Sprinkle had done with Acceptance. And we're like, I guess this doesn't suck, so I guess we'll go do it with Aaron Sprinkle. So we honestly, we heard that record, and we're like, this sounds great. So that's why we ended up doing the record with him. So for me, I look back on the record, even, again, not to... <clears throat> pat ourselves on our back but uh even the the like cover and the pictures and all of that in the record i feel like it was like i mean that was we did all that in 2002 which is a long time ago and i feel like normally when you do things that long ago it ends up being really stupid now you look back and you're like man what it's a like dumb but even the record yeah it's not embarrassing at all i mean I, I love that record still and i think uh i think it's cool to uh to look back that long ago and still kind of like everything and in the, the decisions that we made so um yeah i really wouldn't change anything i mean like I said, it's, it's really weird because it was so long ago that it's kind of hard to remember it. Like, I look back and I'm like, what? I don't know, it's 15, weird. Yeah, I was 15. 15, too. So, like, I feel like when you're younger, it's like, you know, it's right. that memory of making that record's right up there with, like, riding my bike and, like, <laughs> learning how to read. Yeah.